<laughs> enjoying some sunshine through the day today. Uh, thankful that we are returning to some quieter weather. Expecting that quiet weather to stick around for the next couple of days. A few more clouds in here on Wednesday. The next couple of days also going to be breezy each afternoon. Thursday, the next chance for rain, and it is primarily going to be focused in some of our far southern counties. May clip the Boot Hill, Missouri, northwest Tennessee, and back into western Kentucky. Not expecting much rain further to the north into southern Illinois. Of course, a lot of thunderstorms through the overnight hours. It is a sign that we are getting closer to spring, but things are much quieter right now as we start off the day, and we're actually watching clearing skies from the north and west as some cooler air moving in as well. Uh, right now, 41 in Mount Vernon, 46 in Carbondale, 47 in Harrisburg. We've got 50 in Paducah. Checking in across much of southern Illinois, anywhere from Nashville to Pinckneyville, running about 44 degrees. Anna at 46, while Golconda is currently at 48. Metropolis still at 51. Ridgeway, you're at 47, and McLeansboro currently at 46 degrees. Western Kentucky, yeah, the, still some of that warmer air uh, associated with the cold front still lingering around. Murray at 57, while Union City's at 57 as well. And Princeton at 53. Clinton, Kentucky currently at 52 degrees. Donovan, Missouri at 48. Frederick down at 46. Uh, Sykeston at 50. And Carothersville in the boot heel of Missouri at 56 degrees right now. Perryville still at 42. Starting to get the first glimpses of light on the horizon there. And a few spots already seeing breaks in the clouds. We will see clearing skies here through the rest of this morning. Live view out of SIC. Looking back, and there's the water tower there and very noticeable uh, to our north Peoria at 30, while St. Louis is at 41 to our south and east. Nashville, of course, getting hit with some storms overnight at 55, while Memphis is currently at a 60 degrees. So there is some cooler air across the Midwest, though the sunshine really going to offset some of that cooler air here for the next few days. High pressure going to take control from the west that high back into western Kansas right now. We'll start to gradually shift to the east over the next couple of days, keeping most of the storm activity and most of the rain well to our south, at least through the middle of of the week. Take advantage of some of the nice weather next couple of days. Breeze out of the west and northwest today. That's kind of the one downside. If you want to find something to complain about today's weather, it will be a bit breezy this afternoon. Otherwise, quieter weather sticks around for the next few days. Wednesday afternoon, a few more clouds in here as a storm system passes well to our south. Shouldn't have any issues here in our region. Upper 50s, low 60s this afternoon. It is wash, rinse, and repeat weather. Upper 50s as well for Wednesday afternoon with the added cloud cover. Maybe a degree or two a bit cooler, but otherwise still pretty Pretty quiet and pretty nice for this time of year. Thursday afternoon, upper 50s and low 60s sticking around. Another cool down on the way by the end of this week. Average high temperature 51 degrees, 60 today though, 59 tomorrow, 60 on Thursday. And we'll dip back towards the end of the week. Friday, the coolest day this week, a high temperature only 49 degrees. We'll quickly bounce back though into the weekend by Sunday. We're back in the lower 60s. 60 today though for a high temperature. Winds out of the north and west. Could see some gusts 20 to 25 miles an hour. Things quiet down pretty quickly this evening. Clear skies and temperatures dropping back into the lower 40s by midnight. Winds going back out of the south and west. So we will hang out in the low 40s until Wednesday morning. Wednesday afternoon 59. A little more cloud cover in here. Friday upper 40s. That's the coolest temperature in the forecast there. Saturday we're into the mid 50s. Should be a very nice day. We'll spring forward lose an hour of sleep uh, Saturday night and into Sunday. Sunday afternoon, a high temperature of 61. We've had a lot of questions about spring forward this year. Of course, in Illinois, the Senate passing a bill that would keep us on daylight right. savings, but it has been stalled in the Senate Quite. and has not yet been voted on in the House. So there are no plans for us Springing to change anyway. what we're doing. Let's get ready to lose that hour of sleep.